So have you decided then? Hmm? What you can do about Liz? Mm. Yeah, I have actually. Put her in a home. I'm gonna give it another go. Really? Really? And you were conscious when you made that decision, were you? Yeah. Give it another go. Okay. Are you staying with crazy tits? Thank you, Dad. Yeah, no, it's her birthday and I'm gonna be nice and get her a nice present and then just see how it goes. Cool. I'm sticking with Liz. Oh, my God, she's so annoying. She goes on about the 70s the whole time, as if she was there, which she was. She's got a thing called a bread maker, so she can make her own bread. I didn't even know you could make your own bread. And her best friend, who's an utter cock, by the way, he drives a black cab, but he's not a taxi driver. That's his own car. It's OK, Johnny, calm down. That guy does sound like a cop. No, I can't do it anymore. I've got to go around to her now. I've got to see her. I've got to talk to her. Oh, my God. Well, She's outside. What? She's outside. She's outside. She's outside. Oh, please don't say it's true. It's true! Oh, shit, what am I going to do? She's locking her car. Don't worry, Johnny. Just talk to her like a man. Yeah, like a really old man. She understands you, then. Shut up! You shut up! She's coming up the drive. Just tell her how you feel. Suicidal. But yeah, you were going to go around and talk to her a second ago. Getting closer. That was before. This is now. I can't just talk to her. About to press the doorbell. Please. Doorbell press. Oh, God. And let the agony begin. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's OK, Johnny. It's OK. <laughs> Don't worry. Calm down. It'll be fine. It won't be fine. Shit, shit, shit. Martin, go and put your shirt on. I'm oh, bleeding out. Well, go on. Just open the door. Just go on, Johnny. OK, I can do it. I can do it. No, I can't do it. I've got to hide. Hide? Yes, hide. Come in. Move, you bloody... Oh, I'm so sorry. I appear to be in your way. Adam. No. Mum, open the door! Open the door! Out of the way, I want to hide! Don't be so stupid! I'm opening it now. I'm hiding in here. Oh, Christ, it stinks! Enjoy! Mm. Well, tell her how to go away! Jonathan! Jo what are you doing in there? Come here! Oh, Guys, oh, you're a little sore! Sorry, Dad! Hello! Uh, hi, I'm Liz. Of course, Liz! Sorry to come round like this, but is Johnny in? Um, what, well, he was, but... Oh, shitting fish! <laughs> Hello, babe. Yes, and since 1945, they've closed over 90% of the British shipyards. 90%. Terrible. Oh, here he is. Hello. Hello. Hi, piss face. Got rid of that fishy smell. Yes, thank you. It's a medical problem. Thank you again. Oh, sorry, Johnny. Oh, thanks, Dad. You all right? Yeah. It's really nice to properly meet your mum and dad. And future brother-in-law. <laughs> well... <laughs> what happened to your hand, by the way? I was bitten. Bitten? Johnny bit him? Yes, he bit me. Oh, happy birthday for tomorrow. Oh, yes! Happy birthday! Thanks. How did you know? Johnny hasn't stopped talking about it all night. Have you, Johnny? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, do you like my hair? Um, it's very short. Don't you like it? Yeah. No, it's... Oh, God. Do you think it makes me look like a man? <laughs> of course not. Oh, no. Don't be silly, love. I knew I shouldn't have cut it myself. It's too short, isn't it? It is a bit short. Martin, no, it's lovely. No, really... <sighs> Different. Um, Mum, can I just get something from there? What? Oh! One second, Liz. One second, babe. One second. Actually, your hair is particularly short.